teacher tech guides. In today's video, we are going to be going over how to make Schoology assignments and Schoology tests and quizzes read aloud with your own audio voice on them for your students. This video should be quicker than most videos, so hopefully you enjoy it. So uh, right here, I already have a previously made assessment. Now, if we click on this question, it's going to load up the multiple choice. Now, when this happens, right now, as you can see, there's no audio files. So if you click here and you go to the toolbar and you click the little music note called tools, you are able to choose audio player. So you can actually record your audio here. Then you have to allow your microphone. And then all you have to do is click here to begin. Now, the kind of part that's a little frustrating is you can't see what you're saying. So, you know, if you haven't done this before, what I recommend is taking out your phone and taking a picture of your questions or your entire phrases of just the entire question. And now you have it on your phone, so you're able to read it from there. So I just took a picture on my phone with it. So this part is only going to read the top because each of these audio files can only last one minute. So you're going to record audio. Click here to begin recording, and I make no promises on how this is going to look once we press here because I don't know what happens between screen recording and audio recording, but let's find out. So click here to begin recording. An ecological footprint is. So then we can play it back. An ecological footprint is. That's good. So now I've hit OK. It uploads to the question. So now it should be in there and it'll be on a bar play style. So now it's there. Now for students, if you hit the preview question, this is what it'll look like for them. So if they click it here, an ecological footprint is. And you can go through and do that for each one of your questions. Now, you know, I'll save the time for you to do it here. But I will show you just one more time. So we click here. We click the note. We click record audio. Click to begin. A mark a shoe makes in soft ground. Then we can play it back to make sure it sounds good. A mark a shoe makes in soft ground. And then that adds the audio bar there. We can save it. So now if we go back to preview the question, they're there for the student to click to read. Now there are some other options besides making it a bar. Uh, let's take a quick look at that, why don't we? So you see right here we can make it minimal or display as text or an image. Personally, minimal is not bad. So let's see what that looks like. So now you'll see it's sitting there smaller, but minimal is also making it unavailable as to why I do not know. So we will just go back and re-edit that audio to be a bar. Good, see, all fixed. All right, now let's switch over to tests and quizzes. So tests and quizzes is the green puzzle piece in Schoology. And it's a little bit different. It only has one option for audio, and it's right here. So once again, highly recommend that when you before you go to record that you take that picture of your question. But this time, we're going to have to do a picture of the whole thing because there's no second like microphone over here. So we click here to microphone, audio only, start recording. Organisms such as plants that make up their own food are called what? Autotrophs, heterotrophs, thiacloids. And then that's how you would insert the recording for that. 
save question. And now you'll see this has an audio recording. So if we go to preview. Now this will have to download the audio. So I highly recommend using the assessments over the tests and quizzes. But a little quick announcement on that is that the assessments currently does not have it set up to where you can bank your questions. They are currently working on that. But um, so that just means that once you've made a test once, you can't reuse any of the questions you've made as far as like making a copy of them to another test. So everything will have to be remade once. But to be honest with you, the audio recordings go really quick. It's smooth. And I don't see really any issues. So with that, that will conclude this video. And if you have any other questions, comments, or concerns, please feel free to add them to the comments. And you know, a like or a subscribe always helps me out. So thanks, and have a great day.